I'm Brian. And I'm Cecilia. Welcome back to the wood shop. Today we're going to do another video in our reclaimed wood series. We're going to be using these same fence pickets we made the picture frame with to make a nice wooden crate. Stay tuned. For the first step in our project, we're going to clean these boards up just a little bit by sawing off the ends where the screw holes are. <laughs> Okay, now it's time to make some measurements. Our crate's going to be 16 inches long by 12 inches wide, and these boards are 5 eighths of an inch thick. So we'll have to cut our length at 14 and 3 quarters since we have to account for the 5 eighths of an inch on each end. Well, now that we have all of our boards cut to length, it's time to start ripping these things. And now, none of them are the same width. Some of them are five and a quarter, some are five and a half. So I'm gonna have to try to get these as close as I can down to five and an eighth. That way the blade kerf will take off the eighth inch and I'll have two equal two and a half inch pieces. Now that all of our boards are five and an eighth wide, it's time to rip them in half. After that, sanding. Now that we've cut all the boards for our crate, it's time to begin sanding. But before we do that, let's recap all the measurements for each plank. We have eight planks that are two and a half inches by 14 and three quarters. We also have eight planks that are two and a half inches by 12 inches. For the bottom of our crate, we have six planks that are two and a half inches by 10 and three quarters. And then for the frame to hold our crate together, we have four pieces that are two and a half inches by 10 inches. And then kind of the oddball here, we have uh, two pieces that are one and seven eighths by nine and three quarters. <laughs> Thank you. 
Now that the boards are all sanded, I'm going to cut some holes in the short ends with a jigsaw for handles. Before we assemble our crate, the last thing we're going to do is lightly sand up in these crate handles so we don't get splinters or anything when we lift the crate. So we'll go ahead and take care of that right now and then we'll start putting the crate together. Okay, everything's cut and sanded. Looks like we're ready to start putting this thing together. We'll start with the long sides first.
It's finally finished, our beautiful and functional reclaimed wood wooden crate. Now there's nothing perfect about this. These fence pickets have been out in the weather their whole life. A lot of warping and bowing. Unless you have a planer and a joiner and stuff, you can't get this perfect, so don't worry about that. Its rustic charm is part of what makes it so lovely. We really hope you've enjoyed watching this video. Thanks for joining us. If you want to see more great projects just like this, hit that subscribe button. We're also on Facebook at Wood Songs by Russell. Thanks again for joining us. Happy woodworking!